Hey, it's Jabbo. Welcome to Trains Are Fun. We're going to be opening this package that came all the way from Train World in New York. Our favorite place to buy trains. Trainworld.com. Easy to find. Large selection. Any of the new things you want, you can find there. This is hashtag not sponsored. All right. So this is something we've had pre-ordered for a while. And it has finally been released. And we're happy to show it to you. Look at that. Ooh. It's Origin James. I actually got the name here. Origin James. Electrically operated with moving eyes. Blister pack as they tend to do with the uh, Bachman HO scale trains. There's other things that you can also find at Train World. But James in his shiny black paintwork. So I don't like blister packs because they're not good for storing your locomotives when you're not using them. I'm working on a new storage solution for my HO scale trains. Hopefully it'll be here in the next few days. But I've damaged so many of my locomotives by not having a proper storage system. Should have done this years ago, but now that my collection's so big, it's like, oh, uh, got to do something. <laughs> so I don't break any more locomotives or cars usually i'm breaking the little bits off of the the locomotives because of the way i store them probably because of the way i open them too let's see if i can get james out of here without breaking him nice and we will compare this uh, to some of the other james that we have so let's go put it over there on the layout it's like my camera doesn't know what to do he's so dark it's like it makes the white balance mess up <laughs> but there's the wheels there's this coupler here that connects to the piece on the underside of the tender the tender is very very lightweight and we got the coupler in the back and the painted on red light there uh, so let's put this on the tender or let's put the tender i mean on james it's got that there that it's already picking up dust <laughs> just got him out of the package all right let's test it out wait a minute which way is he going to go oh he went the right way check it out and that was right out of the package i did not do any pre-testing literally just put it on the track oh what happened what happened do I have a dead spot in the track? Let's stop the train. Do I need to clean my track? Probably. I'll run it back over that section of track. Do you not know what happened there? Yeah. Got the moving eyes. Oh! I just ran over a box. <laughs> Coming by the windmill. Oops. There we go. All right, let's do an own board view. We'll go put a camera car on here we'll put the, the good old chuggington flat car behind james and we'll get a camera where did my gopro go this is how i do a lot of my own train view things so we start the camera wait a minute why is it not recording is my battery dead don't tell me my battery's dead oh there it goes it's recording here we go Oh, we had a, a problem with his front wheel. His front guide wheel came off there. Uh-oh. Let's try this. And, of course, I wasn't recording. This thing is loose here. What is, what is going on with that? Why does that wheel keep popping up? Oh, 
there it goes. It's recording. Here we go. And of course I wasn't recording. This thing is loose here. What is what is going on with that? Why does that wheel keep popping up? Not even rolling. Look at that. That is a problem. So these the wheels are not even spinning. So let me figure out what's wrong with that front wheel. All right, so I found the problem. This wheel popped out. I think it's when it derailed or hit that switch, that little piece popped out, and then I popped it right back in. So uh, that was probably my pro fault on that. All right, so this is the part where I accidentally killed my microphone. So this is the new Black James, the Origin James. And I filmed it with Thomas pulling the, the GoPro camera. That was what the footage we had was of that. So it's been working good. I just, I don't know what I did to mess up the wheels at the beginning of the video. But he looks pretty sharp. Yes, doesn't he? So I got the wheel fixed, looking all nice. Beautiful James Origin version. And now let's compare them to the other versions of James that we have. This is the first one I ever got from Bachman. This is the one with the, the old bluish-gray wheels. I never really liked the color of the wheels there. And then they updated it and gave the nicer wheels on the more recent version. And then, of course, we got the Busy Bee James. And now the new James. And we got some coaches for him to pull. The Red Express coaches James will pull. And so let's pull James out. There he goes. You would have had sound of him moving out, you know, if I hadn't killed my microphone. And then I'm going to run these. And I end up having a problem with, he moves there and then he just, oh, he's pushed. Something happened with this one. He got, his, his motor got seized and he didn't work right there. But I, I, you'll see in a minute. He's works. There's nothing wrong with him. I don't know what happened before. He's a good little red engine.
So let me know in the comments below, what do you think of this beautiful Origin James locomotive with the shiny black paintwork with the red trim? I think it looks pretty cool. Some may not like some of the details. I don't know. You let me know. I don't get too worried about it. Trains are fun. See ya.